Hello and welcome to the Rotary in Action podcast. We are here at the Rotary Majlis of Friendship at Expo 2020. This is a beautiful establishment that is sponsored by the Association of Rotary Clubs of the UAE and the objective of this place is to bring together Rotarians from all over the world and that's exactly what it's done. There are pictures upon the wall of Rotarians from the four corners of the world and it's been a pleasure to be here. So the Rotary in Action podcast brings on change makers and leaders from the region and from everywhere because this is Expo and we have people coming in from everywhere. We talk to them about why they love making an impact in the society. And today we have District Governor Ashok Karipatyan with us. We are going to, I'm going to give you some more information about who we have with us before we get to the questions. DG Ashod Karipatyan is the CEO of AB, of AB Communications, the largest advertising holding company in Armenia. He has been a Rota Rotarian for 20 years and he is the district governor of District 2452, which we belong to, along with nine other countries from three different continents, namely Armenia, Georgia, Cyprus, Lebanon, Jordan, Palestine, Bahrain, Sudan and UAE. He is a member of Rotary Club of Gyumri and today we are going to ask you some questions about how Expo has been and how your experience has been. Welcome to the Rotary in Action podcast. We are so happy to have you here. Hello, thank you for inviting me for this meeting. About my experience at Expo, it is fantastic. It's a great opportunity for Dubai to go ahead to step forward and not only for Dubai, all the countries attending Expo, all the organizations got a great chance to show themselves, to show up. That's wonderful. What about your experience in Rotary? Where did your journey with Rotary actually start? I uh, didn't start from Rotaract because uh, at the time Rotary started in Armenia. I was 37 years old. I am in Rotary, it's already 22 years. It is updated information. <laughs> so, but uh, once we started, immediately one Rotaract club was, was started in Armenia, mostly involving our children, children of founding members of Rotary in Armenia. First club started in Armenia in Yerevan. I am from second city of Armenia, Gyumri. I am a member of Gyumri club and Gyumri club was chartered in the 1999. So uh, then I served as the president of the club in 2003-2000 Four, but starting from 90, uh, 2015, another stage, another uh, part of my Rotary experience started with past district governor Christina, who invited me to serve as deputy district governor for Armenia and Georgia. How it happened and how it happens in Rotary. I was attending many international meetings. That's the first indicator of your activity in Rotary. My opinion on it is the same. You and I was identified this way as a person who is willing to be in, in Rotary. Then uh, after serving as deputy district governor, and I hope it was successful year. I was appointed as district chair committee for stewardship. Then when uh, the turn came- in which year? Uh, it was in uh, the next year after my ser service as deputy district governor in 2018-19. And when the, uh, the uh, uh, that time Armenian Rotary started growing, thanks to that appointment. And once uh, time came for the nomination of district governor, and it was turn of Cyprus and Armenia, 
I was nominated by my club as district governor candidate. And I won the election and I was appointed as district governor. Do you have any projects that were taken forward in this year in any of the countries that we mentioned, Armenia, Georgia, Cyprus, Lebanon, Jordan, Palestine, Bahrain, Sudan, and UAE. Was there any project that was, uh, that was very strong in your mind in this year? Yes, we have many, many big projects in district and uh, we are implementing more and more projects. Okay. Can you tell uh, us any one project that you really feel good about? I will mention one last project implemented by my club. It uh, was providing equipment for uh, a humanitarian organization which is running a dental clinic for needy people in distant villages in Armenia. And, uh, mostly uh, in these villages live refugees from other parts of our region, refugees who had to leave their homes, their countries, and uh, to set up a new life in a, a very poor areas. So uh, it, uh, the cost of the project is $103,000. Uh, Rotary Club of Gyumri, together with several other clubs, uh, we bought very vital, important equipment for this clinic. And uh, what is important for me, it is a sustainable project. Years after, this equipment will serve for this, uh, these people. So that the people themselves can uh, take care of the project and keep it continuing even after yes, and the work is done. Yes, and not only themselves, Rotary Club is responsible for sustainability of the project and we do. We have the project committee taking care of sustainability. Uh, one another question that I have um, is, there are a lot of youngsters who want to be part of Rotary and other organization in leadership positions. They want to, some of them even want to take um, the humanitarian cause as a, as a career and work in the NGO sector. Do you have any suggestions or advice for people like that? Young people, it is our future. They are welcomed. You are welcomed to Rotary and Rotaract because you are innovative. You are more advanced and that's uh, a very important part of our membership plan membership strategy to involve more young people and to uh, provide a successful transition of rotaractors into rotary and the last question is do you have a message for the members of rotary of district 2452 as the district yes. governor. Uh, our uh, year team is Rotary Response with Peace. And my message is, it is about peace, but it is not about peace like signed agreements, like declarations. It is about positive peace. Positive peace is something you have in your heart and in your mind. If you are a peaceful person, you will find everywhere the way to deal, even with your opposite part, even, even with your enemies. But in Rotary, we have no enemies. We are all equal. We are, are all in service. And I emphasize this year team uh, as a very important message to district Rotarians and not only our district beyond. Rotary responds with peace. Shortly about Expo. When I first visited Expo, I realized how important it can be 
for our organization to have such a beautiful office, such a nice area, not only for Rotarians, our potential members, people who don't know about Rotary, they can come, they can see who we are, what we are doing, and uh, where we are going, finally. And when, once I met President Shekhar in Praga, Prague, uh, for, uh, when attending the Institute, I invited him. Before we met, uh, made a big uh, gathering with Expo, uh, Rotary organizers of Expo Office, Rotary Association, and we made the decision to have our dignitaries here attending. And I'm uh, very proud that Rotary International President find the uh, possibility and the, his, his time to visit here. It is significant. It is exceptional. I hope this visit will help us to engage more Rotarians and not only Rotarians, other people also to join us to make good all over the world and to be as a service person, service man. Uh, mankind is our business. Projects are our products. And we are proud to show up not for, not for recognition, just to let know what we are doing and to include, to involve more people to join our perfect organization. Fantastic. Thank you so much for your time, DG Ashot. It's a blessing to have you here at the Rotary Majlis of Friendship at Expo. Thank you for inviting me. I wish you good luck, all the best. And hopefully, uh, very soon, we will have in Dubai many other clubs joining our great organization. Amazing. Thank you so much.